this is Stumpy and welcome to another Minecraft Let's Play video and another video inside of Stumpy's lovely world. No, I'm just kidding. It's still me. I was just doing a little Stampy voice. And do you guys know who I am? Yes, I am Stampy Cat's helper, Fizzy Elephant. And today I'm going to do another Minecraft showcase on another Minecraft world I've been working on for quite some time. And I call it Stampy's Lovely World 2.0. And so far I just have a little bit of Stampy's house. But this is not the Stampy's house that you Stampy fans see. If you guys recognize this... This is Stampy Cat's house from Minecraft Story Mode Season 2. So yeah, I, w I worked on this world long ago, and I and ever since I saw, saw Stampy Cat's house in Minecraft Story Mode Season 2, Episode 1, Hero and Re Residence, you Story Mode fans should know what I'm talking about, I decided to wear, why not take Stampy's regular Minecraft house and transform into Story Mode form, where I put Stampy's regular Story Mode house and take the rest of this house and kind of shrink it down a little bit to match this size and change a little bit of stuff and just kind of make it story mode like if you know what I mean so yeah I've been working on some of it. I've been working on this side and I've done an update on it not too long ago in the doghouse and anyways let's go and review the thing so here's Stampy's bedroom and Stampy's story mode house and if we go upstairs I did add this this is the guest room that he has and this is the room of no requirement where Alpha we used to be in. And if we go up here, we have the Parrot Party Tower, just like in his Story Mode House series with Stacy Plays. So yeah, this is what he has, and there's the jukebox in the chest. And if we go... Oh yeah, and I didn't put any parrots because I forgot to. <laughs> So yeah, but I'll put some in later. Then here's the top, and here's this little water thing that he does have on his actual Minecraft house in his lovely world. That goes right into here. And I'm just going to go through this way. So yeah, that's Stampy's main part of the house, which is aka the story mode house. And then we go through here, and this is supposed to be the little chest room that he has. And here's the waterfall that goes into here. Here's the dirt room. And the cobblestone room. We'll go out there later. This way goes into the mine. Didn't make one yet. This way goes out to here. His base would be down there, which I'll build eventually. And this is one of his dog's grave of one of his dogs that passed away in his lovely world. So, so yeah, you Stampy fans that have been watching his lovely world series would know what I mean. I've already shown those rooms. And if we go down here, we have the little way that goes into the nether portal room. This is the chicken, the dog grave that he has. Yeah, quite sad. I've been watching Stampy's Lovely World for quite some time now, and I love it. It's the reason I have my Kingdom World, and it's the reason my channel exists. So yeah, and we pull these levers, and it opens the door. This one just closes the door. And here's the nether portal room with the lava pouring in. This way goes into the nether, which I'm not going to go in at the moment. Open these doors. And we go up. Alright, so that's that. And this is the little brewing room that he does have. And this is the little secret room, which is the enchantment room, which I did change up a little bit to fit in. In here. And then here we have Fred's room, which you Stampy fans would know. And Fred the Enderman is not here at the moment. And we go downstairs, and this is the little crafting room that he has. And this just leads back into here. Then right here we have Stampy's Love Garden. And you, and you Story Mode fans should know this. This is the pawn version of Stampy's Love Garden that went alongside the Story Mode Stampy House right there. <laughs> so yeah, I decided to put this here in the middle of his regular Love Garden as well. And it looks so good. And we go this way. Right down here is supposed to be the Mushroom Farm. Which is kind of regular, I think. I can't remember. I've been looking at David Shepard's videos, tutorials on this whole thing. And I have to shrink everything of what Stampy actually has. To fit in with the Story Mode house and everything. Well, Stampy Story Mode house, I mean. This is a little tree farm and, and the saplings go in there through, through here, into here. Then right here we have the little farm that Stampy has. These are the potatoes, the carrots, the beetroots, the wheat, 
the cactus, the sugar cane, and the nether warts that he gets from the nether. Then this is the little chicken farm. Yay, look at all the chickens swimming around in there. Let's see how many eggs I got. Wow, I got a lot of eggs. I can make me lots of eggs on egg omelets with that. That'd be amazing. Alright. Now I'll go to this part of the house. Oh yeah, that's right. And here's the real front door to his house. Right here. Yeah, I had the shore in it as well. This is paths. I'll do the rest of everything later. I might just do his town. I don't know about doing his fun land. I'll have to wait and see. Also, I am planning to do like a little miniature building series of me b building part of Stampy Slowly World 2.0 and the rest of his house in story mode form. Kind of like what Kua did where he was building Romeo Berg from Minecraft story mode and he sped up his video a little bit. I might do something like that in the future. I'll have to wait and see. Here's the wheat room. This is the water room. And also, I ballistic squid room would be right here, but... Stampy no longer has that in his house today, I don't, I, I think, so I'm not going to bother putting it. Then it leads out to here, this little secret entrance into the water room, where he gets his water. And let me get out the door. Then right here goes to the lava room. This is another dog grave, Snowy the dog. And here's the lava room. Yeah, I would be very careful. And he literally built this in his lovely world, no joking. Those of you that I've never seen Stampy. Alright, show those. Now we go on to the other parts, and right here is supposed to be the doghouse, which I just built today. And I did do a little bit of changes here since. Well, it's kind of hard to explain. The floor was a bit lower to, to here since. Since I kind of made everything a little small, so yeah, there was there's some things that are out of place. You guys should know what I'm talking about. So I just put a little staircase where you go up and down. Then this way goes into Stampy's dog room. Didn't place any dogs yet, but I will. Yeah, I just built this today. And this is the pork chop and bone thing. So you get a pork chop and you get a bone. Now I'm going to put all these back. And I think i pretty much shown everything, I believe. And right here we'll go to the slime farm, which is not built yet, but will be eventually. Shown all this. This is where, like, his little farm will be in. His mom thing will be. And everything else I'll put later in the future. But yeah, I think I've pretty much shown everything, I believe. Shown up there and down there. In through there. So yeah, I think that's pretty much everything, and I've shown up there already. So yeah, that's a little sneak peek of my review on my custom Stampy Slowly World 2.0 Minecraft World with Stampy's Minecraft Story Mode house and his other parts of his house and everything. So yeah, guys, that's the end of this video. And if you guys do like trains, then go to my second channel, World Philosophy Reductions, where you can check all out. And subscribe to this channel if you like gaming content and my little pony content. So yeah, guys, that's the end of this video. Remember to punch the subscribe button, click the ding-ling bell, comment, and like the video. And as always, guys, I'll see you next one. Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. Bye.